optically pumped magnetometers are high sensitivity quantum sensors that take advantage of the unique alkali vapor properties and their interaction with external magnetic and laser fields to detect magnetic fields with unpresentable sensitivity. Magnetic fields carry important information in biomedicine, in geophysics and in space science and magnetometers are developed to make that information available to us. The Atomic Quantum Optics Group at ICFO is one of the main partners of the Maximal Collaboration on designing and developing compact quantum sensors that will be applied in magnetoencephalography or simply MEG. So magnetoencephalography, or MEG for short, is an imaging technique for investigating human brain function by measuring the weak magnetic fields generated by electric currents in neurons. MEG allows the measurement of ongoing brain activity millisecond by millisecond with the ability to localize active regions with good spatial resolution. Of course, OPM sensors also have weaknesses when compared to superconducting sensors. They are still quite expensive, the noise level is typically higher, the bandwidth is limited, the outer surface of the sensors can be quite hot, the response is nonlinear, and there can be significant crosstalk when the sensors are placed in dense arrays. We are focusing on these weaknesses in the Maximal project. For example, we have applied ceramic vacuum packaging to reduce the surface temperature and self-canceling coils to linearize the sensor with negative feedback without producing crosstalk. We have chosen manufacturing methods that are scalable in mass production to reduce cost. The core of the packages is our in-house low temperature co-fired ceramic technology. This LTC technology utilizes individual glass ceramic sheets, which are first processed separately, followed by stacking them accurately together. This stack is then laminated, followed by firing at a temperature of less than 900 degrees. The technology enables some benefits over its competing alternatives, such as printed circuit board or other ceramic-based technologies. For the high technology readiness OPM, we have to align the needs of a high-performance sensor with the supply chain for key components, like the laser and other optics. Here at ICFO, we do that by testing existing commercial components for viability, as well as developing alternative measurement strategies that widen the supply options. The magnetic sensitivity of OPMs is fundamentally limited by quantum noise. In these sensors, two quantum systems, atoms and light, interact to produce the signal. Understanding and controlling the quantum noise in this interacting system is an outstanding challenge. In Maximal, we are applying quantum resources like optical and spin squeezing techniques with the aim to improve the performance of all currently existing OPM technologies by suppressing the quantum noise. Here at ICFO, we recently demonstrated the first case in which optical squeezing improves a high-performance optically pumped magnetometer. This probing method is compatible with highest sensitivity OPMs currently employed in medicine, geology, cosmology and fundamental physics. In Maximal, we are also developing cavity microcells based on MEMS technology to combine high magnetic sensitivity with submillimeter spatial resolution. For a volume smaller than one millimeter cube, the atomic projection noise is two orders of magnitude larger with respect to millimeter or centimeter sized cells, thus enabling a better understanding of quantum effects and quantum enhancement. We expect this work to have a positive impact on the development on the next generation of quantum enhanced atomic sensors in both academia and industry.